All right, guys. So, uh, just like every other YouTube channel out there, is about cars. We got a Miata. Well, he did, not me. Got this hoopty. It's not mine. It's not too bad. I mean, it's got a bad wheel bearing, but that's about it. It's a one eight, so the front lip. Yeah, it's got a front lip. It's lowered on some piece of piece of shit springs. And uh, it's a Miata, and I'm a bigger Dude. guy, and I fit in it, so I mean, I'm happy. It ha it it's a what you gonna call it? Plasti dip. Yeah, it's plasti dip. This shit brown, burgundy. You can see where it's peeling. Color, I don't know. <laughs> That's fun. Dirty zone, we're so gonna. Whatever. We're taking out the plasti dip. I don't know when though. He's got a glass top, so I mean, that's good. With the defroster too. Yeah, mine. Mine was shit. Mine was plastic top. Oh, uh, we already. Riser tip, dude. Exhaust. That's dope. That means extra horsepower since it's big. Yeah. It's pretty dope. There's a truck. We're not gonna work on that thing till. After summer, because of all the weather and stuff, we don't want to deal yeah. with the rain getting inside. It's probably been hit up front, but I really oh, yeah. don't care. Too it's much. like the hood. I'm gonna try to line these back up a little bit, but not yet. We can't tell. It looks pretty good. I mean, kind of it's happy. It's a little happy. gay. It's a happy gay Miata. Yeah, so. It's actually pretty dope, though. Not gonna lie. Today we're gonna adjusting the e-brake because the e-brake is shit on it and it's got an open diff so you can't really slide it too well so e-brake will we, help a little bit we need to weld the diff on this thing and weld the diff that will happen soon too mm -hmm. sparkle steering wheel 20 oh, yeah, that's the best part about it 20 pounds of boost <laughs> it's a test what showing how bad the e-brake yeah. is All let's right. test it we're gonna go he's gonna test it i'll, I'll record it huh? is it a muffler delete yeah, yeah, resonated for just my foot to eat. Ooh. Oh, it's not rattling. Rattling. Easy rattles and idle. That's it. You ripped it? Yeah. Dang. That sucks. Okay, that's the before. The after hopefully is way better. We'll work on it. See what we can do. Some VBS. I don't know what those are. I don't know. I sh I know shit about rims. TBH. Some old school Volkswagen BBS. Volkswagen, dude. All right, let's get to it. All right. First thing is take off the rear tire, right? Got jack it off first. Jack it. No, screw jack it. Oh, Just yeah, take it off. A... Just take off the tire. Off Loosen up the tires first off. Before you jack it up or anything, you want to loosen it up, just the bolts a little bit. So like, because if you lift it up and then try to take the tires off or the nuts off, spin. yeah, the tire's just going to spin. Unless you got the e-brake on, but this e-brake is shit, so I don't know how well that'll work. Yeah. Make sure you do it to both sides, not just one. Wait. Okay, never mind. I remember we tied the e-brake on my Miata. Yeah, I remember that. It was still shit though. I know, we should have tightened it a little more. Yeah. Uh, it's meant without the bell on it. It's so, honestly, it's so much faster. It's so light. It really is like super light. It's ridiculous. <sighs> Fitment on, on point. Damn, can you imagine if this thing was this high? Hey, I saw it the other day a lifted ass Miata. Really? Yeah. It was so, it was so gay. They had like big wheels. Honestly. They're, they're all, bro, they're almost bald. Can you see that? I can't see because of the oh, sun. No. That's Wait, why my brakes are so shitty. It's literally almost gone. You need some new brakes. I'm gonna get the other side of my life to go find the L wrenches. Yeah. Put the tire underneath the car so that the car falls. The tire blows up and not you. What? Nothing's gonna blow up. No, no, it's fine. We already hurricane yeah. tested it. Whoosh. Or earthquake, not hurricane. Yeah, I was going to say. Earthquake test. Oh, I need to take this wheel off. Whee! We find the right size first. To tighten the e brake, which ones do you need? Wait, what do you need to tighten to tighten the e brake? It's just one bolt. Or one nut, can I? One nut, where at? Where not? Oh, it's not the nut. The one that's like right behind the piston back here. If I can. Wait up, put my <laughs> finger on it. It's that one right there. You probably can't see yeah, it. Yeah, you can't see it on camera, but it's somewhere back there. Just somewhere back here, right behind the piston of the brake. Yeah. You gotta take that nut off, and then there's an Allen key in there. 
It was one time a long time ago and John beat me out of it. Yeah. And then after that, you should. So you take the nut off and you tighten it with the Allen key. And that should tighten the e brake. That's just on this wheel though. Then you. I think you go all the way and then you back off just a bit. Yeah. That's just on one wheel. Then you have to do the other wheel. So, Zane wants us to take the plastic dip off. Because honestly, the paint job is so good. It's like so good. I don't know if you can tell on camera, but it's like still shiny and it's not all nasty and stuff like mine was. So we're gonna take the I'm gonna take the plastic dip off while he's still tightening the e-brake. What? I don't know what your Miata looks like. Oh yeah, mine was I'll probably pull up a picture right now and show you what it looked like. It was so ugly. Not a yeah, it wasn't clean. It was. It was on like Steelys, and I mean, it wasn't Miata. It had a wing. And it had a LSD. LSD, yeah. Okay. That was the one thing that made it better than any other Miata. Yeah. All right. Well, I'm gonna be taking the paint off while he's uh, tightening the e-brake, and I'll show you guys what that looks like once we're done. E-brake's done. Is it not? Yep, e-brake. Uh, we, we still haven't tested it, but it seems no. like it's... Dude, really this paint job turned out pretty good. Yeah, and the paint job underneath, like, I did not expect Ho it to be like this. Hopefully it stays that way. Yeah, yeah. hopefully it stays this way. The e-brake now is only, like, a few clicks to the top. A few clicks? It used to be 20 clicks. It used to be, like, 20 clicks, and now it's just... Like, before it would go up there and, like, with ease, now it's, like... That's 12 that's clicks 12 right clicks. there, and it's, like... But that, that was him pulling hard. Yeah. Before it'd go to 20 clicks. Now it's 12 clicks. Yeah, around like 20, maybe a little less than 20. Yeah. Still, like it, it was, it was shitty. Before. Hey, we did something right. Yeah, now I need a, now I need a drift button. A what? Drift button. Drift button, yeah. I almost want one. All right, let's continue. We'll show you what. Now we're feeling the paint. Yeah, now we're playing the paint. Plastic did not paint. Yeah, plastic did. Man, when you put the tires on, it's crisscross. Don't do dot, 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 dot. You know, you guys know. <laughs> yeah, don't be stupid. So after hours and hours of taking off the plastic dip, this stuff would not, like we tried pressure washing it and everything, it did not come off. He says he's gonna try buffing it out, see what happens. It looks so bad. I mean, the rest of the car looks good though. Like the paint job, it's, it's pretty good. I like it. He's gonna leave the, the trunk, but it has it has some imperfections, like you know, that kind of stuff. Oh, and over here the fender, that's the worst. But other than that, the paint job. Oh, this doesn't line up. This doesn't line up. Other than this, and the and the hood, the car, the paint job is pretty good. We're gonna fix this though, huh, Zane? Zane's gonna fix it, not me. I'm gonna just buff all that out at work tomorrow, or not tomorrow, Tuesday. Yeah. And the e-brake, it did shit. E-brake, it, it tightened up a little bit, but it does not lock up for shit. Yeah, no, it's it's pretty much the same. So we're not even gonna show an after. It's like literally the same thing. Yeah. You can't tell when it when he rips. Yeah. That's it, you guys. Thank you for watching. Yeah. See you next time.